Hey guys, my name is Sam's Knight, and welcome back to Vampire! Now, we're about to make a progeny. We're about to become a vampire parent. Isn't that sweet? I feel like this is not the right way to go. Just a hunch. Oh, I guess I wasn't even really supposed to find this hideout. This hideout has nothing to do with what I was doing. Scoob is still on the desk. As from last episode, because I'm kind of rolling right into this one. Um, what is this window? Oh, the music hit a note that I haven't heard. Okay, so... Scuba don't! Scuba don't! Scoob! She's misbehaving and she knows it. <laughs> She's ignoring me on purpose. It seems like right here is where I need to be. Why can't I get in? Why can't I get in? Might have to go up on this side of it. Scuba, do not. <sighs> Just like the last episode, the cats are losing their minds. On purpose, I think. So... I'm gonna eat people if I can. Gonna kinda try and stay on the main story line for a bit. I just walked right by him. You sure? I feel like anywhere I am is safe. I feel like I'm doing just fine by myself. I'm gonna try and stay on the main story path for a bit. I wanna at least hit, hit chapter 6, so that way I'm in the last chapter of the game, because I'm in chapter 5 right now. Uh... I want to get into chapter 6 as soon as possible, because then I know chapter 6, you know, you're going to start wrapping shit up. So that's when I'm, I would prefer to start killing everyone, so that Dawson's way... mansion. Here I am at last. But the question remains. Am I ready to make a dying man my progeny? And there's Lilith, the Halloween cat. Where's my cape? Oh, my cape's right here. Cape is here, neck is still stiff, so I'm not wearing it, but no matter what, if I somehow blitz the rest of this game in the next couple hours, because I have several hours to myself, I ain't got nothing else to do, so I'm going to be recording a lot of this. I might record some Minecraft today, too. The last episode of Minecraft, episode, like, seven, I think, was just a disaster, and I'm putting it off as long as I can. I'll go back in the sewers and find what's-his-face found out about this weapon in this game called Dragon's Bane. You have to get all the collectibles and then do a puzzle or two or something like that. I'm not going to be able to get that, I don't think. At least not right now. Finally you're here, Dr. Reed. What took you so long? I had to pass several of your barricades and outposts to access your mansion, sir. Death, pestilence surround us, and time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, blood transfusion equipment available. All this could be so useful in a hospital. Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. Most thoughtful. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself would help me to escape the Reaper. Very well. But before I proceed, I have a few questions for you. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. First of all, I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed planned very carefully. I'm the only vampire in the room for now, so please indulge me. All right, all right. What is it you wish to ask? I will Cats. become your maker. Do you understand what that means? Mm. Well, I certainly won't consider you my liege or some such drivel. You can be assured of that. This is Lilith. <laughs> what do you know about the guard of Prewood? 
What I do know is that I'll crush anyone or anything that would dare to oppose me. Ah, he's one of them. You'll need to feed on warm blood. Blood from mortals. How do you feel about that? I'm rich, Dr. Reed, and powerful. I'm sure I'll be able to acquire all the blood I need without ever having to sully my own hands. Let's move on then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my life waning with every moment. But first, before you embrace immortality, what would you do with such a gift? It's That's a rather impertinent question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer me all the same. What will your first action be as an immortal? To save London. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. Quarantine is not a bad idea, medically speaking. But I'm convinced this epidemic will not be contained by mere walls. As long as the right people are on the right side of the wall, that's all that matters. But you can't guarantee infection will not spread. Just one contagious carrier would be enough to create an apocalypse. The apocalypse is already knocking at the gate. We must be strong now. What if a new outbreak happens inside your walls? You'll have created a giant trap. That won't happen. As long as we dispose of anyone that is contaminated as soon as they are spotted. You really plan to build a quarantine wall across London? Yes. It will be tall and strong, separating the wheat from the chaff. By doing so, you will also create two separate prisons. Come, sir. An eminent doctor like yourself knows that such radical measures have proved efficient in the past. Let me guess. You mean to isolate the rich from the poor? This is a desperate measure for desperate times. England must prevail, Doctor, no matter the cost. Hmm. I don't like that. Who gave you the right to decide the fate of thousands of people? My money. My money and my pending immortality gives me the needed authority, Doctor. I'm a businessman. I'm used to tough decisions. I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. I want to kill At him last. instead. All right, do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. I've been preparing such a long time for this. Oh, yes. You don't deserve immortality, Mr. Dawson. What? What are you prattling on about? I don't believe I've ever met a man so bereft of empathy. You, sir, are despicable. No! Wait! You can't! I made a deal with Lord Redgrave. I'll finance whatever he wants. Please, just ask him. Sleep now. Rest now. Forever. <laughs> That was not only a selfish decision, but also a selfless decision. I wanted the 2000 experience, sure. I would have lived forever. Who are you to decide my fate? Who gave you the authority? That man was disgusting. Prepare to die, damn straight. Hang on. Oh, my mesmerized level went up. Hang on, I just gotta make sure that that was recording because... That was a big moment. Okay, it was. Hint fail. I don't care. That dude needed to go. Third key. Just shit, this dude's got keys up the ass. I don't care about the district. I'm going to eat everyone in this game anyway. I might, I might have to find Nurse Crane again, though. What did I get from that? Ooh, stuff. Um, there's several keys and several safes. Oh, Lord Led Redgrave's here. Why is he here? <laughs> I mean, I'll fight him too. I don't give a shit. I ain't about to let this corrupt, nasty ass 
group of people. What if I take it over for myself? I'm stronger than Redgrave anyway, and I'll let women in and everything. I'll do all the good guy things while also murdering everybody. It's fine. It doesn't matter. Oh. Didn't I get three keys? I think I got three keys. I murdered that man, and it felt great. Hmm. Is it done, Dr. Reed? Is Aloysius Dawson reborn as expected? Alas, Aloysius Dawson was not brought back to life after his death. The man is gone. What? What happened? I could not let such a dangerous man become immortal. Not from my blood, not for you. This is an outrage beyond words. This is betrayal, pure and simple. I should kill you on the spot. You swore on William Marshall's blood. Oh, well, yeah. Get rid of me, then. From now on, you're an outcast. Banished. You are forbidden to ever appear in front of us again. Ascalon will smite you on sight, and your heart will be thrown to the rats. I'll leave you, then. Have fun with your puppets and shadow plays, Lord Redgrave. Yes, go, traitor, and take that awful creature, that counterfeit of a woman I saw waiting for you, and be gone! Protect the Pembroke Hospital? From what? Uh, should I have lied there? I also feel like giving him one of these. So, I stand by it. Ah, Scuba's looking at me like I should have lied. I should have lied, huh, Gooba? Hmm? Oh. What are you doing here? We meet again at the strangest of times, young Econ. So do you serve the Earl of Bristol now? Old Bridget? What are you doing here? Your friend, the wise Econ. She sent me to warn you. Lady Ashbury? You know her? Tell me what's going on. The lady approached me but a few nights ago, wanting to meet the sewer skulls. Once she questioned Harriet Jones, she agreed to help us. Harriet Jones is still with you then? How is she doing? Harriet remains angry, but is <laughs> recovering slowly. Her mind is twisted, but at least her body is healing. Tell me what is going on. The lady asked us to keep an eye on your mortal doctor friend while you were away. And? We spotted the hunters. They were discussing plans to attack tonight. No time to lose, then. I must go there right away. I shall return to my den. Have you a message for the lady? Should I see her before you? Yes. Tell her I love her. Is this still unknown to her? Go now and take care, young Econ. For the flames I sense a romance. I'm trying to kick it off. Well, hang on. I understand that there's something super urgent going, like, happening. But also... There's someone I forgot I left in the sewers. And I hate the sewers. But I gotta go back and get them. Because that stupid thing... What? Where am I? Good evening, Miss Price. How are you tonight? Dr. Reed! I didn't know you had returned from the war. I had a new doctor when you left, but he's not as kind as you. I'm gonna Always eat glad you. to see a former patient in good condition. Too long in Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to do this. I, I hit the wrong button, I swear it. Let her go, let her go, let her go, let her go, let her go. I mean, I'm going to eventually, but not yet. See, look, she's got... I gotta fix her first. And she's a shopkeeper. Good evening. You know... May I look... It's always a... This is what I wanted. She ain't got nothing good. 
I mean, she's got stuff. Oh, wait, I need those. Okay, I'm good. Never... Never eat someone without healing them first. Wait, can I? I can eat him now, though. Oh, but see, here's the thing. I keep saving them because I don't want to eat them just yet because I feel like they can give me quests and they, if they're around longer, maybe something different will happen. But at the same time, at one point, I just start need to start digging in. This is the Dracula playthrough after all. Though I'll be dead. I'll be the most powerful vampire you've ever seen. Anything scuba? <laughs> Alright, I need to find s someone down here. Common axe! Nice! I don't know how to... I'm working on finding you to help with the situation at hand. Am I... Ah, there ain't no way a map's gonna help me right now. Ah. There we go. Oopsie daisy. Hmm. It's locked. Probably should be. Um. It seemed as if I was closest back over there, though. Yeah, back over here. I'm on the same level and everything. And I get here. And I'm like 10 meters away. Oh, here we go. Are no match for me. Let me go, you as long as she didn't see what I just did, everything should be fine. Destroying this guy. Ew. I'm gonna eat you, though. Is the thing, Miss Teasdale? Are you all right? How do you know my name? Who are you? My name is Doctor Reed. I managed to track you down thanks to your father. So my father really was looking after me. This man, this vampire, told me my father was dead. Is it true? I'm afraid so, miss. I'm so sorry for your loss. But you are free to go, as your abductor is no more. I suppose my jailer also killed my father, didn't he? Thankfully, he did not search your father's corpse, where I found his notes describing where he might find you. You should read them. I must find my father's body. He deserves a proper burial. Goodbye. I'll, I'll see her somewhere else, and I'll eat her then. See, now that that's done, she'll be available to eat somewhere else. I should start saying drink, because eat has like a sexual connotation. And then that's not what Samsonite Productions is all about. Michaela and I are going on a date tonight. Just arranged. She wants Chinese. She just texted me. She's at she's at uh she's at school right now. She's been doing so good too. Like I'm really proud of her, man. She's got like 
Although there's this one program that she's been using that keeps sticking her over. Where am I? I wish this game had a fast travel system. You can't tell me they couldn't have made like a cool animation with like turning into bats or some shit. I ref Oh, excuse me. I refuse to believe that. How do I get home? Okay, if I just keep walking along this path, everything will be fine. Oh, thank God. You know what? You're fine. I'm an agent of chaos. <laughs> I let the, the deadly live. What is this? Hello, Mr. Petrescu. Hello, Dr. Reed. Oh, yeah, you! I forgot about you! Where are you? Where did you go? Do I have the yes. cure for you? Do you need some hand vet? Well, I think you can read drugs from. Do you need some help? I am. Nice. I don't want to kill him just yet. I don't want to cause collapse until towards the end of the game. And I know I am towards the end of the game, but I don't want to cause collapse until, like, the latest possible moment. And then I'll go around and murder everyone. It'll be like a whole thing. She also has pneumonia. Oh, is she the, um, lady of the night, so to speak? Did I kill anyone this episode? I know I've killed someone recently. But was that like this episode? I was gonna. I almost killed that shopkeeper woman. You London vampires. Shut up. Ow. Ow. Bye, sweetie. Why? This is a, f a losing fight right here. Audi. Shit. Yeah. <clears throat> Why is there a big tall boy? He reminds me of that big silver dude. Whoops. From uh, that big silver X Men from X Man from Deadpool. Am I right, or am I right? Can I get up there? Can I open this? It's locked, all right. I cannot. Okay, well... Oh, I remember you! Not me. How are you? I'm not your boy, all right? Do you need assistance? Please. There you go. Very funny. Huh. <laughs> That's cute. Well. I'm just happy that everyone has given me the, uh, I don't need permission, so to speak, but, like, the go-ahead to murder everybody. Come on now. There's got to be shadows nearby. Oh. Don't mind me. I'm just taking him for a walk. This is my... This is my... This is my friend. <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, I wish I could move quicker than one mile an hour when eating people. Alright, come on. This is redonkulous. No one can see me. This is fine. There we go. I should have done that one a long time ago. And you can't tell me that's going to affect the district all that bad no, because... Not now. Not me. Please. Yeah, I'll, I'll be, be good. good. My ass. You're, you're dead. 
Oh, I get I get stuff from them? I didn't know that. I'd be eating people left and right if I known that. Hang on. Alright, stop with the dark, evil, mean music. It's making me feel bad about what I just did. It always does, and I don't know why. I, I was for a minute and then I couldn't hold my tongue anymore. Ow! Alright, I'm gonna kick your ass, bitch. Shit! Oh my god, that almost killed you. I don't want the big boy right, right just yet. Where's the little boy? There's the little boy. I'm working on the little boy right now. Are you from Ascalon? Because I'd like to start murdering you all. Like, as soon as possible. I can't get out of here. There we go. Ow! Whoa. Whoa. Ow. Okay, so this is a much better strategy than what I was doing. Now I just get to beat up the big boy. Oh god, he hits hard. I, uh, Cayman, don't, Cayman, don't. Cayman, don't, Cayman! I apologize for the way my cats have been ruining everything in the past video and a half. You ever just, like, do something for so long you just want it to be over? Come on, Cayman. Uh. Oh, what? You disrupt everything and now you want to leave? Go. Go on, then. Go on, then. Okay, then get away from the window! God! <laughs> Why is everything around me just... Interrupting the episode constantly. Hello. Don't really want to deal with that. Yeah, oh Christ is right. I'm just passing through, just passing through. You guys can have your skirmish. Cayman, stop it. Jesus Lord <laughs> The cats constantly irritating me tonight today. It's not nighttime. It's daytime. It's freezing outside though. What is this truck? Are the vampire hunters here already? Wait, I need to eat these people. Good evening, Mr. F Good evening, Doc. Is there anything real? I need the treatment for sepsis. Oh, Goodbye. For oh no, the hospital clearly has not been attacked. I need two cures for sepsis. I'm gonna start eating people a little bit quicker now. Those bastards. What have they done to Edgar? Looks like he's wounded. I better follow the blood. Well, before I follow anything, I'm going to go to my room. <laughs> so spoiled, like. I cannot enter. Where's my room? It's up here, is it not? There it is. 
Um, I want to try and upgrade that saber that I got. Uh, oh, I got a common axe. Well, that's not as good as the remarkable crudgel. I need five lead rods to get it up to level five. You. This. No. This. Damage dealt. Stamina consumption. Absorb blood points or stamina consumption. Damn, the stamina's already pretty low. Um, I mean, that's a pretty good weapon. It's just not up to par with. I'm gonna save, sleep for the whole night, and then go help the doc. How much to upgrade Abyss? Ooh, I could do it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. No! Healing. I need a lot to finish up the healing. Um, I don't know how to do that. Can I up my bite? I can. Ooh, increase your life regeneration when using bite in combat. I can't do anymore. Damn it. Is there a 300? 600... 600, 300, and 300. There we go. Uh, I just want to get to level 28. Like, bad. Oh, uh, no. Confirm. Boom. Hi, Scooby! Scooby! Scooby's right there. Terrible news for London. The death of Aloysius Dawes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I did that on purpose. Is this... It's only down to critical? Oh, he was a pillar. Okay, so I still have a lot of eating to do. Level 5 mesmerized, though. The highest I've seen besides 20 is 6. But like I said, I don't even think I have investigations to work on right now yeah local investigations all those are done oh, I have the braille thing and that's it so yeah I'm gonna stay on the uh, wait hang on I have to check really quick I don't have a timer anymore but exploit uh, now rec okay so I got another about 30 minutes that's cool I've been trying to do about roughly hour-long episodes of this whoops I, oh, yeah, I need to start curing people around here and eating them as well. Because, as you guys know, I'm now doing the Dracula playthrough where I kill every last person. The Castlevania playthrough. Hi, Scuba! You're my cat, and I love you! <coughs> this episode's been kind of wild. I killed... Oh. Oh, this looks like a boss fight. Probably for the best that I upgraded beforehand. Ultraviolet curtains and ori calcium powder. Dr. Swansea's always been a resourceful bastard. I bet he never told you he had this installed in case of a vampire attack. Says a lot about how much he trusts you. What have you done with Edgar? Don't worry. We don't kill humans. Even if your friend is deserving of a little punishment for one. What are you talking about? We know everything. Swansea and you created this bloody epidemic. 
What? to unleash another disaster, just like William Marshall did. No, I'm trying to put an end to it, just like you are. You're the progeny, aren't you? Where is the monster hiding? It's still in England, isn't it? I have no idea what you're talking about. <clears throat> Jeffrey, please listen to me. No tricks. That shit won't work on me. We've found proof in the theater. Doris Fletcher was your first experiment. Now where is Marshall? Speak! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> so much for modern technology. Time for the tried and true. Like I said, boss fight. Do you fight. know what this is, beast? This is a drop of King Arthur's blood. The blood of a true defender of Britain. Stronger than your evil powers. This is ridiculous. We're losing precious time. True enough. Soon I'll bring your head before your coward of a father. I know! It hurts, doesn't it? Ow! Come on now. Oh, oh, oh. I got no blood. Is it? Is it? About to find out. True light will cleanse you. Whoa, that gives me a lot of health now. I'll you down. Will you? Are you sure? Vampire senses aren't working. I'm trying to like scan the dude to see what he's like weak against, but I just can't for some reason. Show some style. Fight like a man. Yummy time. What are you doing? The blood of a true defender of this land will protect me. You are incorrect. <laughs> I am very low on stamina. Although this new heal is great. <laughs> oh my god, when you parry them like that, they look so sad and upset. He resisted it, but it, he took 500 damage anyway. I'm not trying to bite you, though. Well, yes, I am. I take that back. Dude just got, like, non-stop... Like, it's, he's got, like, average damage. But, like... His, um... He's got average damage, but his defense is, like, crazy high, man. Ow. Ow. Again, stop. Stop. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Show some style. Fight like a man. I got it. I got it. I got it, buddy. Yummy, yummy time! Man, this is actually a, a, this is my favorite fight so far. I think it's got like I like it. It's got the the cool. Um, if you're so innocent, why does simple night burn you so? Shut up. Because I'm a vampire, clearly. I've been biting the shit out of you. I'm not innocent. I've been killing most of London. 
I never claim to be a saint, Broham. Ow. True light will cleanse you. Uh Another bite. I think it's kind of cool that Swansea has this light Close thing. Your eyes. This is gonna hurt. Ow. You're about dead, bro. We are the guardian of justice. Prewin shall prevail. You can't accept the fact we're not enemies, can you? <laughs> we always have been, and we always will be. Of all the evils that threaten mankind, your kind are the worst. I was only reborn for a few minutes before you and your men hunted me down like a beast. You were only reborn for a few minutes, and you'd already taken the life of an innocent woman. There is no way you'll ever let me be, McCollum. You'll always hunt me down, won't you? There is no escape, Leech. Kill me now, for there is no way you can sway me to your ideals. Okay. That is the type of playthrough I've committed to doing. That's where you're mistaken. What do you mean? Oh. Oh. I could turn him. I'll spare him. I'll spare you, McCollum. I'll offer you the mercy you never offered me. What is this ruse? This is no ruse, McCollum. This is me letting you go. After all, you and I are both trying to save this poor country in our own way. That would have been cool to turn him, but that doesn't seem logical to me. I'll kill you, Reed. Next time we meet, I'll end you. See? Progress already. You called me by my name. Until the next time. Goodbye, Hunter. That was... That was my favorite... That's my favorite thing that's happened so far. It was basically a Belmont. And I love it. I'm telling Michaela about it right now. I can't even help myself. That was the coolest shit. I could have turned him, but I don't see the point in that. I don't see... I mean, I could have had a progeny, but I don't want that kind of responsibility. Rescue Edgar Swansea. Okay. As long as I can do it in the next, like, 15 or so minutes, I can do just that. Why are, Why at Dora's Fletcher's place? Is there someone I can eat here? Uh, yeah, but I don't want to eat the doctors. I kind of want to eat the patients first. Give the doctors a few, like, less stressful final days. You know what I mean? Uh, we got the doc. Uh, another doc. Another, you. You're the one. What are you? You have sepsis. Do I have the cure for Good that? Good evening, mister. Good evening. Medical checkup. Really? I don't have I'm it. Damn. Good. I'm gonna go create the cure for sepsis. And fatigue. Those two things, and then I'll go get Swansea. That was a badass uh, chain of events right there with the uh, with jo uh, I want to call him Joffrey because that's the way his, it, it looks like his. It, but with Jeffrey, the hunter, uh, cure for I don't have the cure for sepsis. That makes me upset. 
Oh, I already had the thing for fatigue. Whoops. Okay, well. I can still evolve. I just would like to evolve with more. Might kill the doctor. I mean, I'll cure him now, but I don't want to. I don't know if I should kill him just yet or not. I'm quite. Do you need my? Don't be ridiculous. Then you are lucky that I have. I wish this hospital could have received as much attention from you, Doctor Reed. We do not see you in surgery very often. I could kill you. Thank you for your. I will kill him. I'm currently working on. Why can't I cure migraines? Why is that not a thing I can do? I feel like I've cured this guy like three times. Milton. Okay. Sepsis. I don't have the cure for sepsis. I might start killing people while they're sick just to kill everyone. You know what I mean? I snuck by you, you definitely didn't notice. Haha, -ha. tricked again. Whoa. Oh, he's from Ascalon. Whoa, 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 whoa! Quit it. Bip and a boop goes a long way. Bip and a boop. <laughs> Ow. Just watch this. Bip. I didn't even need the boop on that one. Alright, I need y'all to like stop noticing me now. Please. I have no idea what they want with Dr. Swansea. I think they're mad at him because he was helping vampires. If I had to make a guess on something. Yeah, you're you're a, kind of a dick and I want you dead. <laughs> What an eating sound. Oh yeah. I'm eating the shit out of these bad guys. Whoa. Actually, they're not really bad guys. I feel kind of bad for killing them because like, they're just trying to hunt vampires. They're trying to, in their mind, keep this place safe. Yeah, I don't really want to deal with this anymore. I'd like to get on with the story, please. 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 Okay, here we go. 
Remember, if you're not strong enough, remember that the blood of citizens is the fastest way to walk. Dude, I'm working on that, alright? You guys can see it. I'm working on it. So Prewin never left Doris's theater after they invaded. They must be holding Edgar here in their new headquarters. I'm beat the shit out of you because I don't know where to go. So I'm just gonna beat the shit out of you. I love the music in this game, dude. A lot of bad guys. Very quickly becoming outnumbered. And that claw attack that I do is literally not even as strong as just one swing from my weapon now. It's the weaker than just... That's the thing though, it doesn't use stamina. <laughs> this is blood though, which I could use to heal. Beep, boop. Oh. I'm eating you! That doesn't even bother me. I'm in the middle of eating someone. Don't want to deal with it. Don't want to deal with it. I don't want to constantly have to keep dealing with you. Gather information. Gather, gather information. What information? Where? Oh, he's downstairs. All right, just like I had to say, go downstairs. Lead plate. I need those. I believe there's stairs going down over here. Now. Why <coughs> would you stay where a big meanie vampire stayed? Maybe to send a message, I guess. I don't really understand these guys. I'm back here. It's locked. It's always locked. Don't know how to get downstairs. Investigate his kidnapping. I, I know where he is. I just don't know how to get there. He's under the damn stage. I think I just destroyed him. I think I just destroyed him so hard. There's voices happening. I can't get to where I need to get to. It's gotta be a zoop voop, right? Where I can go zoop voop. Where? Why? How? Where? This is despicable. Is it this way? Ooh, new direction. Well, that's the way out. Give me that. Oh, Doris Fletcher's diary. Okay. Ain't nothing else to do, though. Where is Swansea? Where is Swansea? I hear you shouting. I think I've killed just about everyone. If not everyone. I don't know how to get down there to him. Itchy. See, okay, this is as close as I can get, is just down on the stage. I can't get under the stage. See, there he is.
Gotta be. Oh. Okay, so there's a whole underground level I'm missing. If I follow the bodies. I mean, it's an alright idea, but I'm not seeing how to do that. Especially considering that this is the only, like, way to go here. I'm confused. So there's that. Oh. Okay. So there's that. Who's yelling? I cannot enter. I cannot find my way into the sub levels of this place. I'm going to cut into when I find it, because this episode's probably hitting its max. Doris Fletcher was about to become a disaster. I'm getting close to having all the evidence. I think I just found what I needed to find. Yep. Hmm. Yep, okay. I just kept yapping. I literally only had to cut out about a minute. Probably right in there. <laughs> Lead rod. It's locked. It's locked. Oh, the vampire knight. That's that's cool. Um how do I get in there? It's locked, all right. Okay. So now how do I get in there? It's locked. How do I get inside? What am I supposed to do? It's locked, all right. Oh. Oh. Blood of a pure heart, garlic, blood of a king. I don't understand. Perhaps this is what McCullum drank. I had better keep that in mind. Edgar. Edgar, can you hear me? Jonathan, is it really you? I thought I just cut his head off for just a split second. Easy. Save your strength. I'm getting you out of here. Don't try to spare me. As a physician, I know all too well when it's too late. Punctured lung, broken ribs, internal bleeding. An accurate diagnosis, wouldn't you say? Edgar. What happened? They wanted me to confess. Beat me black and blue. Jeffrey McCollum ambushed me at the Pembroke Hospital. He was convinced you and I were responsible for the Skull epidemic. I never imagined that self-righteous fanatic would... 
dare to attack us in the open? What became of him? To prove him wrong, I let him go. Really? Are you sure that was the wisest course of action? Time will tell. The most intriguing part of his accusation was that you and I were the pawns of some ancient vampire. William Marshall. Yes, they... Uh, they tortured me to make me confess the same ones. I think you're hiding something, Edgar. What do you mean? William Marshall, for example. You speak of him as if you know him. How is that? Uh, Jonathan, I... I cannot say I'm ready for another round of questions. While investigating the epidemic, I read some of McCullum's findings. I think you have some explaining to do. I have nothing to hide, Jonathan. Nothing at all. Doris Fletcher visited her mother at the Pembroke Hospital. That's how she first got infected. I know nothing about that. Miss Fletcher once came to visit the sick. That is all I know. No, Edgar, there is more. Doris Fletcher was Harriet Jones's daughter. They exhibited the same symptoms. Blind hate and strong physical mutation. What does this sad story have to do with us? Doris and Harriet shared more than a hidden family bond. They were the embodiment of the epidemic and are linked to the Pembroke Hospital. Come on, Edgar, this is no coincidence. I swear, I'm at a complete loss. All I did was administer vampire blood to cure old Harriet. There was no evil plan, no diabolical plot. You did what? I tested the regenerating and healing properties of vampire blood on Harriet Jones. My only intention was to find the cure for influenza, I swear. Whose blood did you use? William Marshall's? Mine? Lady Ashbury's. While transfusing her with human blood, humanely appeasing her hunger, I also kept samples of her blood for my research. You used her blood on Harriet Jones? My God, Edgar, that's unethical. You betrayed two of your patients at the same time. How dare you judge me? Must I name the alarming list of your victims? We are both deceivers. But at least I know I'm a monster. You have worked beside me. You saw what I'm doing at Pembroke Hospital. Jonathan, you know I'm not an evil soul. Just another victim of this tragedy. Oh. No matter what, he's going to die or become a vamp. Well, I told you I'd kill everybody. Yes. You asked for it. Your Here death it is imminent, Dr. Swansea. But I swear, it will be quick. I already told you to call me Edgar. Am I no longer your friend? I believe you never have been, sir. You have lied to me at every step and betrayed the trust of a woman I cherish. You, you and the lady? Really? Well, I should have seen it coming, I suppose. May I add that I welcome this. The biting I made. You have your wish. Is it going to hurt? I always wondered if you... Ah! Yes. Yes, it will. Probably need to go find Nurse Crane and mesmerize her. Holy shit. I am in the final final chapter. I need to evolve. I'm well aware that this district is going to crumble now. <clears throat> I think it's almost time for me to to kill everybody. What what, what do you think? Cayman! 
Go! Damn. I'm sorry for that constantly happening. It's never been this bad before. I'm gonna get back to the hospital. I'm gonna save. And then I'm gonna try and destroy the world in the final chapter of the game. Side quests, what are those? You want a completion? I mean, you knew coming into this, after I started saying the Dracula playthrough stuff, you knew that this wasn't going to be a completionist run. And I'm going to play through this the sweet and tender way in my own time, and I guarantee you everyone that plays this on, on YouTube is like, Oh, look, I'm a nice So Howard nice Jones way. became the original carrier when Edgar gave her that I must tell Elizabeth. Is this a safe house? This doesn't feel like a safe house to me. Ow. Where's the nearest safe house? Right there. The way I'm facing. Woo! Woo! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Hee You gotta do give him the little beep boop. I'm trying! Do I ever find out who my maker is? Because if we're in the final chapter of the game, there's also like a an epilogue. Probably about an hour long, maybe less. It's one of them. Away with you. Oh. A leech! A leech! Where it oh it's like right here. Ah. Wonderful. I have to kill Who's that? Hate? No thanks. There we go. Yeah, just don't worry about it. We'll all walk home together. Ah, level 32. See, I need to get up there. Yes. Safe and sound, safe and sound. Do can I create sodium high nope. Not even gonna. Okay, where's the bed, man? I ain't never had this much experience to spend it once. Oh, it's safe. It's locked alright. Mm -hmm. About to get some good. Why don't I have these yet? I want this one. I would kill. It would kill me to say that I didn't have all of them. Alright, now. I'm gonna go for those are maxed. Uh, what do I want here? Healing. There we go. I've maxed up my healing. Let's do my ultimate a little bit. Man, that's a lot of juice. I still got a thousand points left over. Ooh, what do I put them in? Blood. Probably blood. Wait. 600, 600. Okay, yeah, I get more blood from biting people. I'm level 30. And that's it for this roller coaster of an episode. Anarchy? Why? What happened? The White Chapel. Oh no, Edgar Swansea. Yeah, I I understand. Oh my God, what's the point in even trying? Whoa. Why are they all dead? Why is everyone dead at at the hospital? Oh my god. Okay, well, we're gonna explore that a little bit in the next episode, so be sure to check in for that, because see you there.